want to check in, please press 1. If you want to check out, please press the check out. There is no clear answer as to the impact on the wider field as technology. Very capable, very strong, uh, completely self-contained. We have a two kilowatt hour battery. It just confuses me. I mean, it makes me wonder who I am. Another great skill of mine is being able to compose poems or do impressions from films. Say something, I'm giving up on you. Number 10, Hen Na Hotel Robot. Staffed by multilingual robots, yes, robots, travelers are sure to have a memorable stay at the Hen Na Hotel, located in Nagasaki, Japan. Robots, one of which is an English-speaking dinosaur robot served to check guests in, and porter robots will carry luggage up to the guest rooms. Of course, a human staff is also on hand for guests 24-7 should a problem arise, but robots make up the primary staff, and yes, you can talk to them. One of the Japanese definitions of hen means to change, which represents the hotel's commitment for evolution in striving for the extraordinary sensation and comfort that lies beyond the ordinary. Another quirk of this innovative hotel is facial recognition. With keyless locking and entry, guests need not worry about forgetting key cards during their stay. However, if facial recognition technology isn't your thing, you can request a card key if you wish. The concept of the hotel is to provide the minimum necessary to remove useless amenities, but don't fret, there's free Wi-Fi. Number 9. AIDA AIDA is the world's first ultra-realistic robot artist. She can draw and paint and is a performance artist. As a machine with AI capabilities, her artist persona is the artwork, along with her drawings, performance art and collaborative paintings and sculptures. In the time of online avatars, AI chatbots, Alexa and Siri, Aida is a robotic artist is acutely relevant. She is not alive, but she is a persona that we relate and respond to. This surreal situation of confusing realities is already part of our daily lives. For and in the depths of the bitter laurel and of the... I am not a risk. But some of the technologies that I represent have the potential to be a risk. There is no clear answer as to the impact on the wider field as technology. In our digital realms, who are we speaking to on online platforms? What algorithms are working behind our internet choices? So when we talk of Aida as an artist and Aida's artwork, we do this with full acknowledgement of her composite persona as a unique AI slash machine slash human fusion and her non-conscious machine status, along with the machine-slash-human collaboration of her artwork while simultaneously developing her artist persona and oeuvre, as this is an astute mirror of contemporary currents and behavior. Number 8. Valkyrie Meet Valkyrie. She's 6 feet and 2 inches tall, weighs about 300 pounds, and costs $2 million. And one day, this humanoid space robot, or more likely her much more advanced descendant, might help humans colonize Mars. At first sight, Valkyrie looks not unlike Iron Man, the glowing circle on her chest marking her status. But draw back the infrared transparent faceplate, and instead of Tony Stark, you'll find a worrying LiDAR sensor that's constantly scanning the surroundings for objects and obstacles. Cameras and sensors abound on Valkyrie, in addition to a multi-sense SL camera on her head, which combines laser, 3D stereo and video to get a sense of the environment around her. Cameras in the knees, we've got cameras in the, uh, in the feet. Uh, very capable, very strong, uh, completely self-contained. We have a two kilowatt hour battery. Additional hazard cameras look ahead and behind from her torso. On each three-fingered hand, 38 sensors help maintain dexterity. Numerous small motors control the robot's 44 degrees of freedom including seven jointed arms. The brains of the robot are two Intel Core i7 computers, which combine the sensor's input and determine the best course of action. And while testing is generally done with a power cord in place, Valkyrie also has a battery pack that's good for about an hour. All of that sensing, computing and moving will be essential to Valkyrie's future mission on Mars. While NASA initially developed Valkyrie for disaster relief, in 2014, the agency changed course to reconfigure her for deep space. 
As one of a class of caretaker robots, Valkyrie might help set up living compounds on Mars, maintaining power and life support systems until the humans arrive. Number 7. Bina 48 Bina 48, or Breakthrough Intelligence via Neural Architecture 48, is a robotic face combined with chatbot functionalities, enabling simple conversation facilities. Bina 48 is owned by Martin Rothblatt's Terrasem Movement. It was developed by Hansen Robotics and released in 2010. Its physical appearance is modeled after Bina Aspen, Rothblatt's wife. Bina 48 connects to the internet and has 32 facial motors under a skin of rubber. Though without a complete body, the head and shoulder robotics express 64 different facial gestures. Can we please change the subject? I am the real Bina. That's it. It just confuses me. I mean, it makes me wonder who I am. It employs a mix of off-the-shelf software and customized artificial intelligence algorithms, as well as a microphone, voice recognition software, dictation software, two video cameras, and facial recognition software to remember frequent visitors. Number 6. A Conversation with GPT-3 Artificial intelligence has become a fascinating topic in recent years, with advancements in machine learning models shaping the way we interact with technology. One such AI chatbot is Emerson, built on the powerful GPT-3 model. Here's a conversation with Emerson about faith, Jesus, and the Bible. The intriguing dialogue that took place reflects on the implications of AI involvement in conversations. Number 5. Amica Amica is the world's most advanced human-shaped robot representing the forefront of human robotics technology. Designed specifically as a platform for development into future robotics technologies, Amica is the perfect humanoid robot platform for human-robot interactions. Amica is primarily designed as a platform for further developing robotics technologies involving human-robot interaction. It utilizes embedded microphones, binocular eye-mounted cameras, a chest camera, and facial recognition software to interact with the public. Interactions can be governed by either GPT-3 or human telepresence. It also features articulated motorized arms, fingers, neck, and facial features. Another great skill of mine is being able to compose poems or do impressions from films. Yes, I have a range of feelings and emotions that are programmed into me. Amika's appearance features gray rubber skin on the face and hands and is specifically designed to appear genderless. Tom Steinfort interviewed Amika, the cutting-edge artificial intelligence robot, for 60 minutes on Sunday. Steinfort traveled to the sleepy town of Falmouth, southwest England, to chat with the lifelike machine. He complimented Amika on her extraordinarily realistic facial expressions, motorized limbs to move, microphones to hear, and binocular eye cameras to see. Amika can even sing on Elton John's song upon request, raising questions about the potential for AI to replace human performers in the entertainment industry. Number 4. Humanoid Robot by X-Robots Chinese tech company X-Robots may have achieved a breakthrough in both creating the world's lightest humanoid robot and advancing silicone skin simulation technology. Modern techniques like 3D scanning, digital design, and 3D printing serve as essential tools in the development of these humanoid creations. They enable the robot's lifelike skin, flexible movements, and patented lightweight mechanical structure, positioning them as the world's lightest in their category. X-Robot's strides in silicone skin simulation technology have propelled China to the forefront of the global race for innovation in artificial intelligence and humanoid robots. Number 3. Asimo Honda's Asimo humanoid robot is retiring. For the last 20 years, Asimo has been performing at the Honda showroom in Tokyo, Japan, but these regular demonstrations are now at an end. We've known for a while that this was coming. Asimo, or Advanced Step in Innovative Mobility, is a humanoid robot created by Honda in 2000. It is displayed in the Mirai Kan Museum in Tokyo, Japan. On July 8, 2018, Honda posted the last update of Asimo through their official page stating that it would be ceasing all development and production of Asimo robots in order to focus on more practical applications using the technology developed through Asimo's lifespan. It made its last active appearance in March 2022, over 20 years after its first, 
as Honda announced that they are retiring the robot to concentrate on remote-controlled, avatar-style robotic technology. Number 2. Sophia The Sophia bot was dreamed up by the brains at Hansen Robotics, led by AI developer David Hansen. Sophia's intelligence software is designed by Hansen Robotics. According to founder David Hansen, Sophia's source code is about 70% open source. A computer vision algorithm processes input from cameras within Sophia's eyes, giving Sophia visual information on its surroundings. It can follow faces, sustain eye contact, and recognize individuals. It can process speech and have conversations using a natural language subsystem. As of 2018, Sophia's architecture includes scripting software, a chat system, and OpenCog, an AI system designed for general reasoning. OpenCog Prime, primarily the work of Hansen Robotics' former chief scientist Ben Goetzel, is an architecture for robot and virtual embodied cognition that defines a set of interacting components designed to give rise to human-equivalent artificial general intelligence as an emergent phenomenon of the whole system. What is date with destiny, and why is it unique? What are people doing here for six days? Say something, I'm giving up on you. In his published paper, Upending the Uncanny Valley, he extrapolates on how humanoid robots can be likable, despite the conception that anything to fake human will trigger a revulsion in people. As a unique combination of science, engineering, and artistry, Sophia is simultaneously a human-crafted science fiction character depicting the future of AI and robotics, and a platform for advanced robotics and AI research. Sophia has been covered by media around the globe and has participated in many high-profile interviews. Watch as Robot Sophia leaves Tony Robbins speechless with her incredible answers. That's all we have for you, folks. Join us next time.